terrible news for Kansas City Chiefs fans. Running back Clyde Edwards Hilaire, who has yet to play in 2024, appears to be nearing the end of his Kansas City career. Recent team movements indicate that the player may not return to the field anytime soon. Edwards Hilaire, currently on the non-football injury list, has been battling serious mental health issues, including symptoms of PTSD. To his credit, the player has been extremely open about his struggles and how Travis Kelsey has been a pillar of support during this difficult time. However, his on-field recovery seems unlikely anytime soon. Edwards Hilaire is in the final year of his rookie contract and the Chiefs opted not to exercise his fifth year extension clause, making this his fifth season in Kansas City. The current outlook for the Chiefs is also not encouraging in the running back department. Isaiah Pacheco has been placed on the injured list and is expected to be out for six to eight weeks. In response, the team signed Kareem Hunt to the practice squad and he is expected to be promoted to the main roster in time for the game against the Atlanta Falcons this weekend. Given the situation, Edwards Alaire's return seems increasingly distant. If there was any chance of him returning soon, signing Hunt would not have been necessary. But with the lack of news about Edwards Hilaire's potential recovery and the urgency of Pacheco's injury, the Chiefs have had no choice but to look for reinforcements. The sad reality is that we may have seen Clyde Edwards Hilaire's last game in a Chiefs uniform. His NFL career, at least for now, appears to be in jeopardy. While his health and well-being off the field are more important, his journey on the field seems to be coming to an end. The player who showed promise during his rookie season failed to live up to his potential after being selected in the first round of the draft. He has been plagued by injuries and has seen his performance decline year after year. Now, with Pacheco out and Edwards Hilaire unavailable, the Chiefs will have to rely on Kareem Hunt, Samaje Perrine, and rookie Carson Steele to fill the void in the running game. Hunt, who averaged just three yards per carry last year, should be used primarily in short yardage situations and in the red zone. Steele, who impressed in the preseason, remains an unknown quantity. While there is optimism about the youngster, he is still an undrafted rookie and will need to prove himself in the coming weeks. The Chiefs running game will likely rely more on flawless execution than on individual performances. Andy Reid has a history of replacing the running game with short passes and screens, which could be enough to make up for the absences in the backfield. The key for the Chiefs will be to avoid critical mistakes while Patrick Mahomes continues to lead the offense. For Chiefs fans, the big question is, who will be the team's primary running back in the coming weeks? Will it be Samaje Perina, Carson Steele, or Kareem Hunt? Leave your opinion in the comments and see you next time.